Some teachers just know what their calling is and they fit right into their role as a teacher. WNCT's STEM Teacher of the Month began her career only five years ago, but she's already a pro and explains what motivates her every day in the classroom. Angela Green has her story. The banana piano is very popular. <laughs> Students at Pitt County Schools Early College High School are learning to turn anything into a keyboard with these neat invention kits. So they were creating projects like game controllers, um, you know, working on um, creating something that would play music. It's all part of Laurel Curry's lesson plans for her design thinking class, and yes, that includes using bananas. The students were uh, basically building circuits out of everyday materials that would conduct electricity. Curry has only been a teacher for the past five years. Years. I love teaching at schools that uh, really help our students grow and, be, and fulfill their potential. She's learned that this style of teaching suits her best. Like other STEM teachers, she's a facilitator. I want the kids to be able to learn in a way that best suits them, which might not necessarily be how I'm at the front directing the teaching. So if they can build their own knowledge and construct their own worldview, um, then we want to encourage students to do that. Curry says in the future she can see herself becoming an instructional coach and maybe even pursuing her PhD. For now, at the early college, Curry says the students are her biggest motivation. The kids come in, they are so motivated, they want to be here, they they love coming into school, and, and we're just a big family. Mrs. Curry's students have been writing grants for activities they want to do in the classroom. She plans on using her $100 STEM Teacher of the Month award to fund one of those projects. To learn more on how your business can get involved in the STEM initiative in the classrooms or to nominate a STEM teacher, visit our website, WNCT.com.